Hello, and welcome to another playthrough by me, Joester610. Uh, this is gonna be slightly different from our first one, which was Theme Park Tycoon, if you could not remember. Uh, this is an obstacle course game, and so uh, it's called Star Savior, and essentially what you have to do is you have to collect stars to continue through the map until the final round. Of course, uh, there is a second one out, and you may be aware of this, but the series itself follows a storyline, and this one has was also very memorable to me. This game was way ahead of its time when it was made, and it lasted for quite a while. In fact, it still has active players to this very day, which I find incredible because it's fairly old. Like, it was active in 2010, so it's been like, what, seven years, depending on when you're watching this? So, anyway, uh, apparently, I have collected all of the stars already, but it's been like years since I played this game. This is the starting area, uh, but you may be wondering to yourself, But Jouster, how are we going to watch you play this game, if you have beaten it already? Well, uh, it's very simple. I just have a different account that I use whenever I'm going to play through a game that I've already beaten. That way, you guys can get the full experience. So, let's head right into this. This also, let me, let me just add in, this also is halfly I'm recording this series because I want to record the second half of the game, the, the newest version, which was incredibly well made. Uh, and I haven't played that in about like half a year, so. But this one's been like three or four or five years probably since I last played through this game. So uh, it's been an incredibly long time. So I'll probably remember a few things, but it's been a while. So thank you, and let's head right into the other accounts that we can start playing. Oh man, oh man, look at this. Here we are. I mean, holy heck, I am quite the noob. Actually, I think I look pretty cool. You can see, like, the t-shirt, though. Like, look at that. Eh. Anyway, let's check out the tutorial. Oh, wait, 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 we're gonna get some immersive, immersive gameplay here. Let's figure out the storyline, since I haven't really said it anything about that yet. Click to read. Most people will talk to you if you click on them. You can also read signs by clicking on them. Well, that's nice. Let's go to the tutorial center before we click on this guy. You're gonna have to wait, Mr. Spinning Click on me to talk. Actually, I just noticed every single time it flips, it still says the same thing. That means on the other side, it has to say it in reverse. That's pretty cool. I... okay. Okay. Like, all these things are pretty familiar to me. They are also included in the base game, and actually they have the same model, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, they do. That's pretty cool. Uh, if you ever trip over and get stuck, you can press backspace to get right up again. Oh, thank you, Mr. Robloxian. Ahaha. <laughs> Good use. Uh, remember to save your game before you leave. Oh, crud, really? Is that still... is this one of those... Oh my god, that's pretty quick. Sure, let's do it. Boom. Oh. <laughs> ha, nothing to lose. Let's see. Click to read. Eh, I'll explain it all when I get there. <laughs> now, let's read this man's immersive storyline. Hey, are you okay? Did you just see what just happened the other night? This may sound crazy, but all of the stars just fell out of the sky. What? Yes, it's hard to believe. They were all knocked out, and this night sky has become a void. How did this happen? There was an odd character who called himself Stratosphere, who sought out the power of the stars. He knocked them out of the sky and into his reach. So the stars are now scattered? Yes, and he's locked off a lot of the areas so he can hunt for them himself, such as our town. Oh, and then he's gone. There we go. <laughs> uh, I wonder where this leads. What does this man standing in the middle of a very checkered field say? The sky's fall! The sky's fall! Okay. Oh wait, is there some more dialogue to be had there? Tell me your secrets. 
What's wrong? All the stars in the sky, they just disappeared. Some dude just knocked them out of the sky, man! Oh, thanks. Eh. Let's see. What are these fellows apparently talking to each other about? Oh, I can't listen in. I'm not a rocket scientist or anything, but it, but it seems we need a star to open these doors. And then something else. One star required. So these are the stargates, which, by the way, I cannot get through. Well, I mean, let's see. No, well, I, I'm sure if I tried hard enough, I could get through there. But we're not going to, because we're going to do it legitimately. Uh, these will open when I reach the certain star requirements, which can be gotten in here, I believe. Yeah, this is World 1. Let's talk to this fellow. Uh, let's see. I think I saw a few stars fall into these woods. Maybe you'll find some there. Is there anything in these bushes? No. Okay. Whistling woods. Oh, here we go. Well, that was pretty quick. What's this guy? A whistle. Hey, welcome to Whistling Woods. I remember the whistle drive. <laughs> okay. These are pretty weird dudes. Honey is really sticky. Wee you might find you might find you're able to climb it. Well, thanks. Good to know. Uh, oh yeah, red stars. I don't think we're gonna be- I mean, if it comes to it, we might collect a red star. Like, we have to collect eight of these coins here, though. Ooh, the star is trapped in red orb. If you find all eight red coins in this world, you can really get the orb, probably. I mean, yeah, yeah, he's pretty quick- quick speaking. Let's get this red coin. Let's do it. Let's get the red coins, if- if they're not annoying. I mean, I've done it all before, but, you know, if they're easy enough, then I guess I can dedicate some time to that. Uh, so how it goes in these games is that there's usually more than one path that you can take. Uh, it's usually this guy, or this dude here. Either one. Uh, let's see. Okay. So... Oh, man, it doesn't... In the other game, I'm pretty sure it, like, makes them transparent if you get them, but I guess this one doesn't. So, of course, we need to avoid the obstacles, so let's just do that. Oh, oh, oh. So troublesome. We need the lost item. Ooh, this forest is doomed now. Everything is being cut down. Is there a way to revive it? Yes, if only we had the seed of life. If you can find it for me, I would... Okay. If you can find it for me, I would gladly repay, repay you with a priceless star. Is that... Are you... Are you using me? Oh no, floating axes, my worst enemy. Let me just have a nice little walk. Oh. <laughs> I I thought I'd be able to walk through there. Apparently not though. Uh if you find yourself in a situation where you're over a uh over a rapid stream accompanied by waterfalls and there are some axes over on top of that are floating in the air on oh my god. On top of a giant log that is across this large river, ooh, here we go, then, uh, make sure you don't run straight forward. Uh, of course, if you find yourself in that situation, I mean, I mean, I, I find that, my, myself in that kind of a situation daily. Can I walk across? Oh, oh, yes, I can. Oh, that's, that's what I love about this game. This, uh, Explode 1, I believe, makes these games, and for some reason, his games are a lot, a lot better, like, with gameplay. Like, They'll drag you across this axe, unlike other games, which would just make you sit. I don't know what he does to do that, but you actually stick to blocks that you're standing on until you decide to jump off them. Let me just... I mean, I can't say how convenient that's gonna be for people trying to, like, park. Not not to mention, how are they gonna park here? Like, do they drive a car? Like, across here, and down here? And then they're... Why? Just to go to this... Strange shop. Unstaffed, in, in fact. Ooh. I mean, there's one thing they're selling I want. And that's, uh, views. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Let me climb up here into this inconspicuous shelf hole. Oh, what have they got going back here? What's in here? Oh, it's death. Death is inside of that hole. 
<gasps> oh! Okay. Let's see. We have to push this crate. We have to push this crate along here. Let's do this. Okay. Okay. Get this crate. There we go. Got it. And I'm through. Ooh, there's another crate. Now I know not to go into there, because you'll die. I know. Move it. <laughs> Move it! Oh, oh, oh. Better push, 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 push. Oh, that actually will take a while. Hey! Hey! Our first star! We got a star! We did it! I'm pretty sure each of the stars have their own names, too. Box sorting. Easy. Well, okay, so what's the hard- there is no hard, but I'm sure we'll get there. So there should be- there's usually- oh man, I'm not even gonna try to figure out, like, the number of- I'm pretty sure- okay, okay, let me- let me grab my words. Let's see. There is usually a certain, like, amount of stars in a map, but I'm pretty sure that's only with the second game. With this particular game, I guess it's just, you know, whatever whatever st uh, number of stars the game creator wanted to put in there. Let's take this route! Yeah! Oh, we're leaving the, the building. Going down this... Uh, there's a lot of mushrooms around. Keep in mind, this game was made in 2010, and there were not that many games like this out there. This game was, like, beautiful. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Let me just avoid this guy. Yeah, he did probably not slam down onto my body and cut me in half if I... I mean, how are these axes moving on a literal basis? Like... <coughs> right down that... Hey, look, a star! Well, that that star's presence sure, sure is looking nice. I will go and grab that one right up. That seemed awfully too easy. If that's a medium... Okay, good. It's not- it's not a medium star. So we've completed this path. We don't need to go up there anymore. So now, let's climb this honey like this- this- this dude here advised us. I don't even know what those are. They're kind of weird. They make me uncomfortable. Whee! Okay. Hey, look. I'm prancing through the- through the flowers. Ha oh, ha, look at all these guys. I kind of remember where these were, but it's just like I see this tree and I know at some point in time I arced my camera around there. I'm surprised this is all still working though, because usually games this old break. Whistle. The tree forts this way, tweep. What a weirdo. What a weirdo, am I right? <laughs> wonder where the I wonder where the coin is, dude. Uh, I got it. Wait, did I? Hey, I think I have all eight stars. We're, we'll make sure to get that. Ooh, there's two routes. There's two routes you can tell by the neon blue path. Let's go down this this guy, of course. Um, I already did it. Oh, an enemy. Dude, you're standing there, boys. Wee, watch out. These buggers are nasty. A couple of jumps on their back should defeat them. You know, last I checked, a bugger was uh, a dangerous alien. That, that word with humanity long ago. Oh, oh look at them. Now, aren't I, aren't I supposed to be able to- Ow, gosh! Okay, they do damage, but I get like a weird force field. That's super cool, though. That must be the seed of life. Okay. What a strange place to put a seed of life. Ooh, there we go. Oh, that was a close one. Hey, look, I have. well, I don't really- it's invisible. It's invisible when I get it. Oh, oh. Stay away from me! Ah! Ah! You will not defeat me! Ah! Oh. This is, uh... Let me be careful! Oh. I did it! I got him! This one's gonna be medium, right? No, it's easy! Squish the bugs! There were only two bugs! What are you talking about? Uh... Let me go get this guy. Look at this! Boom! You just got a star! Windswept Pass. Seed of Life. Oh! Oh yeah, the Seed of Life! I got that guy too! Wait, it's down here, isn't it? Can I- At what distance can I click? Am I able to, like, give it back like this? Hey! Oh! Oh! 
Oh. Ooh, the forest is doomed now. Uh. Oh, I have to actually hand it. I thought I could just like click, and then you know I'd I'd win. But apparently not. Look, I just got a star. Thank you. Um. Uh. Uh. The seed of life. Okay, we have two of them. I don't recall. Wait, did I miss something? What did I miss? Canopy climb. What? Windswept path. Is there? Are there two stars up? <laughs> what did I miss? Where did I miss it? Ah! Oh well. I'm sure we'll find it. We've got five stars already. That's five times as much as you need to get into Mayonnaise Town, which is not the name, but I think it's funny. Oh no! No! Okay, okay, yeah. Okay. Whee! Let me just grab onto these honeycombs. You know, that reminds me of a certain game. I mean, I can't put my finger on what the game was called, but... Oh, oh here we go. Hopefully this carries me. They usually do. Oh, see that? Other games wouldn't be able to do that, but this one, for some reason... Uh, you can't climb those. Let's see. Did these disappear? Oh, these are supposed to be clouds if we're going full roleplay mode. Oh, look, they they do fall. They do. What does this do? Oh, is that where another star is? Oh, I see. So there are two stars. Ooh, let's go for this top guy first. Huh, good thing I noticed that. Uh, let's do this. Let's do this. This canopy path is very confusing. Follow the branches. Okay, thanks. Oh, I bet there's gonna be little holes inside of here, isn't there? Like, somewhere. Uh, uh. Okay. Blind! Oh, man, that was so close. See, that's 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 the technique. Is you you look into the, you use your camera angle a lot with any given game on Roblox. That's some nice wood texture. I mean, the game creator didn't make that, but hey, it's still pretty cool. Looks like what? Oh, wait, am I about to die? No. Okay. I bet if you fell from here, you'd die. Oh, oh, oh. Bring me up. Is this the medium one? Um, canopy climb, yeah. Windswept Pass is the last little dude here in this area. I will be done with this forest after that. Wowie. This is a lot more exciting than a tycoon game, I would say so myself. Uh, obstacle course games are always fun. It's... Well, I mean, agility in Roblox is something that you always need to go for, eventually. Uh, becoming good at obstacle courses pretty much means that you'll be able to dodge uh, incoming project- Oh my gosh, that was a close one. I did not expect it to continuously slow down, but I probably should have. Becoming good at obstacle course games, though, is very good. Oh, there's- Oh, it's supposed to be very windy. Oh, I see, because- Look at this. They're probably going to push me in different directions. Look, ah! Uh, if I touch this, do I die? No, okay. Ugh. Eh! 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 Ah! I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna make it all the way. Whee! I got him. J610. J under six... Under <laughs> J under 610610. No, that's not my name. Underscore. But these are now under 610, so hopefully I remember that. And now, I have all of them. That's pretty good! We're out of here, stupid, weird, whistle dudes. No worries. No worries, sir. You need not worry, we are entering Mayonnaise Town. Actually, I do recall one thing, and that's this dude. Uh, that is one of the secret stars, which are essentially stars that are hidden somewhere on the main map, I believe. 
So, this one's behind the tutorial, and I noticed that guy a little bit ago. And I remembered, oh yeah! Oh heck, there's a weird lava jump guy. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! Oh, let me get on here, I already know. I already know it's coming. Ugh! Oh no! <laughs> Do I start back at the beginning? That would be pretty cool. Oh no, I'm gonna start here. Yeah, that makes more sense. I'm coming for you. One shot. One shot. Let's do this. Big shot. No. Huh? <laughs> that was a pretty close one. That's like pushing me to the edge, quote unquote. I did it though. I got the secret star. Okay. Let's enter this mayonnaise town. Yeah, I just ran into that guy. That's why you stay on the paths. Wild animals could get you. <laughs> um... Oof. There we go. There's that door animation, which was surprisingly good back then. Here's a blank sign. Oh wait, no it's not. Notice, you may experience momentary lag as new songs are played. Oh. Yeah, that's one of the sad parts about this game, is that new sounds are not being played. Yep, that's right. This bass music that you've been hearing this whole time is permanent. Yep, it is seriously there forever. So, uh, stay with me, please. Um, I messaged the creator about it, but it's probably not gonna do much good. I'd be pretty surprised to get a reply, though, because he's pretty famous. Uh, here we go. Here's this very, very important-looking fellow. Oh, it's the mayor. Oh, you were the one who opened that gate blocking the entrance. Yes, that was me. I must applaud your efforts, then. You see, I am the mayor of Maytown. My name is Maynot. Say, do you think you could do a favor for me? Oh yeah, sure, a little tiny favor. Well, there is a bunch of other gates similar to the one you just opened, blocking off many parts of- Okay, I'm done. Yeah, just kidding. That's not a favor, though. Dude, you're asking a lot of me. Precisely. You catch on pretty quickly. But these ones seem a little harder to open, and require m <laughs> and they require more stars. I'm pretty sure these ones isn't correct grammar. Uh, who cares about that, though? This is Roblox. You could try looking in Pharaoh Falls. Okay, thank you. There's groups of people speaking to each other. You can tell by the fact that they are facing at each other. World 3 and 6. These large doors are all over the place. I... C Wait. What? I believe that you need a certain amount of stars to open them. Whoa, really? Dude. Wait. I just had a memory. Is it... Oh. oh! Yes! There is a star in here! I could... I knew it! I knew there was something with that fountain. There's a little rope to climb up, by the way. I'm pretty sure this is what ropes look like. Yeah, okay. Yeah, thank god I remember that. We're, we're going in. Oh, these are the force field things. Here. The force field power-up protects you for, with a force field for a few moments. While it's equipped, you are invincible. This stuff probably kills you. Let's see... let's go. Ooh. Oh, it's pushing me. Oh no, there's a maze in here! And it's po- oh my gosh, okay. I guess I'm looking for the entrance to the star or something? Oh, well, um... Here it is! <laughs> You've got the new secret st Wait, was- but was that... Maytown Caves? Wait... Was that the- was that the one behind the cage? Cause I could've sworn it looked if. Was the one behind the cave not real? Oh, who knows? Hopefully I remember to check back there if I run into like some kind of weird star problem or I miss one of them. But, let's follow the mayor's directions and head this way. Okay, here we go. Isn't that a little park area? Yeah, it is. Wait. 
No, it's bricked off. Two world two. Wow, inconspicuous literal temp. Yeah, I just remembered this. Must not be that great to have me remember all these things, but hey, I guess I have a reasonable memory. Also, there would be intense music playing, I can also remember that. Oh, this one is reasonably harder than the others. Oh! oh. No problemo though, oh. No problemo for the old Justice 610. Oh, here's this guy. I jump on his head, I believe. Yeah, I sent him flying like that. Oh, yeah, I have to get the key! That's right, they have keys in this. You have to get keys to open certain doors and places. Man, this game was so fun! It really was! I love this game. I love this creator, and they always make awesome games. We're probably gonna end up playing all of their games, honestly. Now, of course, obstacle courses are something I'm very good at, but also not the only thing I play, so... You can expect a lot more con- like, content from different types of games. I play it all. Literally all of the games. Ow! Oh, you're gonna kill me, aren't you? Are you just gonna push me, or are you gonna- Ah, there's no escape! Well, that- that- there it was. There was the escape. I got the secret star! Which one was it? Uh, the hard lead canyon. Wait, was- okay. There's impossible. Shadow- I- I am- quite certain that it's not impossible to get that. But you know. Shadow red coins, what was that? Uh, is that just collecting all the red coins? Oh, who knows. Uh, let's see. Um, let's go into Pharaoh Falls. Oh man, look how intense these guys are. You know what? I'm gonna stop the episode right there. Thank you for watching, uh, the first episode of the new Star Savior series, which I am now going to be making. <laughs> uh, I will play through the entirety of this game, I've decided. Every last star in the game, on video. It's gonna be great! So, make sure to keep in tune for that, or if they're already out, which is most likely the case, uh, then just keep watching, if you're enjoying yourself. <laughs> But, uh, always make sure to like and subscribe, because it helps me a lot. It helps me get known. Because, though I do do this for a hobby, you know, if you like what you see, then it'll help. Thank you. And I'll see you next episode.